Royals, what's going on? It's your girl Q the Queen here, back with another video. Now, I was thinking recently, when uh, kind of thinking over my collection, what are some pairs that I wouldn't mind having a second pair of, basically? So, if you know anything about me, I'm really not one of those buy one to rock, buy one to stock type collectors. Um, I know some of y'all, y'all live by that, y'all die by that. That's that's kind of your core principle when you're buying your, your pairs or whatever. But I just, I've never been that person. Um, no, no, no offense, but I always felt like it was just kind of wasteful, especially having so many pairs and not really wearing them often enough to beat them up like that. But I was just thinking like, okay, well, if I did, buy a second pair of something what would those particular ones be and I'm just gonna show you a few of the ones in my collection um, maybe I'll make it a series where I do a few different ones in different videos but anyway we're gonna get into it but first if you're loving the channel make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're liking the content hit that like button helps your girl in the algorithm so I can be found around these YouTube streets and uh, if you have any thoughts concerns any feedback hit that comment section because me and my Royals we talks about it all right first up I'm gonna go with one that is probably very common and you probably would want multiple pairs of this one as well boom here we go so First up is obviously Jordan 11 Concord, man. Jordan 11 Concord, this is the 45 pair, the high cut pair, the pair that I absolutely think is the best pair out of all the retro versions of this particular silhouette and colorway, okay? Um, now, I would want a second pair for obvious reasons. I mean, Icy, icy soles, you know, after a while, this is not going to feel or look, it's already oxidized in a little bit there. Nylon, netted sort of material up top that is, because it's not leather, um, in this particular part of the shoe, listen, I'm going to just say this. So outside of me just loving this pair and feeling like a second pair is necessary, every time I've worn this pair, and I've only worn them like two or three times some sort of disaster strikes. The very first time I wore this shoe, I got ketchup spilled on them. I think the second time, somehow a mysterious dust came across the entire side. There's a reason why I'm showing this particular shoe. The other side, the other shoe, is actually dusty on the lateral side. I don't know what I brushed up against. I was just minding my own business per usual. Both times I wore these. And I can't win for losing. So now I got to figure out how to best clean the upper to kind of get it back to that look I want. So um, that's pretty much one of the reasons why I would want another pair of these. So I can get one. I can start fresh. I can be more mindful when I'm wearing them. But just overall, a second pair. This pair to me is kind of like Michael Jackson's penny loafers and glitter shoes, right? But Michael Jordan wore these. It's just how he looked when he wore these it just looked masterful it looked magical all of the things so but yeah jordan 11 concord <laughs> i would not mind a second pair of these man Ugh, tell me y'all concord story do y'all have some disasters that have happened when you wore this shoe anyway we're gonna move on to the next one next up is the lebron soldier 3 um, and this is just a, a regular, just um, midnight navy and silver colorway here. Um, so this is actually a team colorway. And so the reason why I want a second pair of these is because the only reason I have this team colorway is because I do not have the Akron. The Akron is the actual pair that I want that is a similar colorway to this, except where you see like the silver, it actually has gold um, around it and um, kind of a gold trim. I will just call it a gold trim just to be a little bit more uh, short-winded with this. But yeah, man, so um, Soldier 3 is actually one of the best soldiers to me in terms of the look. Um, it, it You're probably thinking it has a similar look to Jordan 11 and you are not wrong. You are not wrong, but um, it's a LeBron, so 
<laughs> mind your business. <laughs> That's <laughs> mind your business. Um, but anyway, yeah. So I would want a second pair of these specifically to have the pair that I truly, truly want. And don't get me wrong, this is clean. I love it, it's functional, all of the things, right? But it is not the accurate. Once I find them, I'm, I'll feel better about um, having this particular silhouette in the colorway that I want it in. The right colorway, the signature colorway. So, the Bronze Soldier 3. Next up, Jordan 13, he got game. Okay, so first and foremost, I am not. Let me just do a quick little turn around because I just think the shoe is beautiful. But um, I am not a Jordan 13 head, okay? So I do not want to come off as if that's what this is, okay? This is one of my all-time favorite Jordan 13s, if not the all-time favorite. It's between these and the breads, and I think these top the breads. But anyway... This is, I would want to say comparity just because I want it to stay pristine. Like, I wear these a few more times. I'm feeling like they gonna have a little bit of a, a not necessarily a beat look to them, but they'll definitely, um, to me, they won't look as just pristine, man. <laughs> and shoes are meant to be worn, but uh, some shoes just deserve to just look beautiful all the time. And this is one of them for me, man. <laughs> I just, <laughs> this is one of the pairs, man. I lusted after this pair when they first uh, dropped in the 90s, man. And uh, having it in hand and just uh, in all of its glory. I just don't want this thing to look dusty ever. I just don't, right? But yeah, man, this is one of the pairs that I would want a second pair of um, if I were to, to live that type of lifestyle, right? Um, but yeah, man, got a couple wears out of them. Definitely plan to wear them a couple times this year and just throughout the duration of me having the shoe. But again, it is one of those where I would want to go ahead and uh, get a second pair. I actually need to clean these up a little bit. So but yeah, man, Jordan 13, he got game. Lastly, is the Nike Air Force 180, okay? So this is one of those classic, classic 90s basketball silhouettes. Um, Charles Barkley wore this shoe. Um, it is an Olympic colorway. The silhouette is just, I mean, one, one of my personal faves and um, in this particular colorway. This specific colorway I would definitely want a second pair of these shoes for two reasons. First one is a basic reason. Because I, just like with the He Got Games, I just want these to just stay clean. I don't want them to get creased up. I don't want them to look beat, okay? Um, the other reason is because I didn't jump on these when they did retro. Um, I think it was like 26. 16 or something like that and I did not jump on them right away for whatever reason found them at the outlet of course got a good deal and a steal at the outlet but it was in the seven and a half I could not find my size eight in these and actually I wear these in the eight or eight and a half um, I do have another colorway of these which is an eight and a half and it fits perfectly but anyway seven and a half because I was desperate for this colorway because I slept again no no clue why but I need them in the right size and then um, just needing that extra one just to, to keep them clean, keep them looking nice, keep them, keep them looking clean. I don't want them to look worn out and beat up. So um, yeah, this is one of the ones. Like I don't wear this a lot just because I'm trying to preserve it. Um, and then I run across my size. This is actually one where I would say, because I know I should be able to get it for a decent price. This is one where probably I would buy another pair. The size alone is a reason for me to buy another pair, okay? So I think I think I could give myself a little bit of grace when it comes to that. But anyway, <laughs> Nike Air Force 180. Definitely wish I had a second pair of, man. Whew, 
because she was beautiful. All right, Royals. So that's just a few pairs I kind of came across that I would definitely, if I were that one to rock, one to stock type, those would be pairs I would buy a second pair of. What are those silhouettes or colorways that y'all either have a one to rock or one to stock or you would want a one to rock or one to stock? Um, I know, listen, I know all of y'all have some pairs where that's important to you, um, where you want more than one. So hit that comment section, let me know. All right, y'all, um, that's it for the video. And until next time, royalty. <laughs> The queen is hyped up. The queen is hyped up.